Good morning, folks. We've got two interesting papers to hit today on the solar effect on Earth, one on the power grids and the other on major flooding events. We'll also run down the latest in solar activity starting with the last 24 hours on our star. It was another relatively quiet day. Solar flaring remains in C-class range. The solar wind and geomagnetic conditions are quiet. We've got some big plasma filaments there straddling the small coronal hole. And we have a couple new sunspots incoming from the far side over on the left. Let's take a peek at the x-ray flux. You see that we are still in C-class range, but with a little resurgence here this morning. They're mostly coming from those new sunspots incoming from the far side. I'll zoom in quickly here so we can see the very first appearance of those umbral cores there at the limb. Solar wind up next, very quiet. Minor variability, stabilized phi angle, and modest plasma density and speed. Those have left the geomagnetic conditions very calm as well. We are down in the low KP range here this morning. First up in the articles is this, an excellent follow-up to the several papers we've already covered this year on solar forcing of major floods, this time extending it back using ancient auroral records from Korea and their largest historical floods. They're seeing the long-term variability, matching the DeVry cycle of 200 years. It's one of the key centennial scale variation cycles of the sun. Lastly today, we've got the USGS publishing a good introductory paper on the solar EMP, the grid impacting solar storm effect through geomagnetic induction of electric currents. If anyone happens to be new here or to the concept that the sun can take down our technology, this is a good place to start. And they do a bit of focus on the 1989 Quebec blackout storm impacts, but focused on the United States. Folks, my next day out at the ranch will be Wednesday. Don't forget we have major events coming up at the ranch, including the return of the conferences. First one is November 2nd. It's going to be a whirlwind of information. I'll make you an expert in the Earth disaster cycle and solar forcing in just one day. ObserverRanch.com We greatly appreciate your support. We'll do this all again tomorrow. Right here, but right now at 6 a.m. in the new Valley of the Sun. Eyes open. No fear. Be safe, everyone.